Similar shapes and area scale factors. Okay, we have this triangle that's split up in a few different ways. We've got parallel lines. The first part we're told the area of ABC is 50, DE is parallel C, AD is 6, DB is 9. So we're told those things. Show clearly why the area of triangle DBC is 30. So um, why is this triangle's area, oops, very poorly drawn, 30? and this one therefore would be 20. Well, it's to do with the bases. So if we've got the base of this triangle, this triangle is going to be, the area of this triangle will be a half times nine times the height. And the area of this triangle is going to be a half times six times the height. So these two triangles, because the height is the same for both of them, they're both this high, um, then Essentially, the only difference between these two is the ratio of the, the base. So the base, this triangle, is 9 to 6. So this is um, 3 to 2. So this triangle, um, for every 2 for that one, there's 3 for this one. So we've got to share the 50 in the ratio of 3 to 2. So we divide by 5 to get 10. And then we do 3 times 10 that gives us 30 centimetres. Now, that's not very well written, but that's essentially the reason why. And it could be written a bit more carefully than that. Okay, uh, but if you've got the ratio there, 3 to 2, and then you've got the, the 30, I suppose really I should put 30 and 20, like that, to get the two marks. Work out the area of BDE. Let's just rub out what I've done there, I made the right mess. So, I've got to work out B, D, and E. Uh, sorry, the area of that triangle, B, D, E. So that's this triangle here. Okay, so with this triangle, it's similar to this triangle. We know the area of that triangle, so let's just have a little look at the scale factors involved. So that's the small triangle. This is the bigger one. If we look at the bottom of the triangles, this one is 9 and this one's 15, because you've got 9 plus 6. So the scale factor going this way is going to be divided by 9 times by 15, and coming back the other way, going from big to small, we're going to be dividing by 15 and times it by 9. So we're trying to work out the small one. So we're coming from the big one, which is 50. We want to work out this one. Now those scale factors are length scale factors. So the scale factor, the length scale factor, um, going from the big one to small one, is going to be equal to divide by 15 times by 9. So that's divide by 15 times by 9 is 9 fifteenths, which is in fact 3 fifths. So 0 0.6 of the original. So the area scale factor, well, we're going to do that twice. We're going to do that for one length and then for another. So we've actually got th 3 fifths times 3 fifths, which is 9 20 fifths. And we know the original area is 50 times by the scale factor, which is 9 over 25. So we divide 50 by 25 to get 2, and 2 9s are 18. You can do all that on a calculator if you want to. But well, that gives you 18 centimetres squared, and that would be the area of the small triangle, because they are similar.